Oh, session control is session control. Session control. Hey, session control, baby. Yeah, yeah. I think when you see something, it's sort of abstract until there's audio. You know, the music is like a cue for your brain to activate. Like, what are you supposed to feel for this? You know, and that, I think music does that. And I think you can change the music to make it do anything you want to. Like you said, the visual is a blank thing you're looking at with silence and you can play anything behind that and get a different mood. It's just what mood are you supposed to invoke? It is kind of a trip that stuff is made in our houses and is playing on the side of this building. It sounds pretty good uh, out in the world, you know? For Glow SF, they sent us a rough of the animation and kind of a vibe of what they were going for and the theme. We don't have total freedom to make anything. We have to make this work within these visual constraints. I think that makes good things happen because a limitation is not always a bad thing. Sometimes the limitation is how can I make the best thing work within this like box, you know? If somebody's got a solid idea for you, it just makes working on it a lot easier. Unless they want to fully trust you and be like, we just want something awesome. We have no clue what it's supposed to be. Then you turn in a bunch of stuff and they're like, wait, now we have an idea. It's not what you did. <laughs> Which happens. Yeah, totally. You got to get over that hurdle. I think it took making music and going on tour to want to figure out how to incorporate music into other things. Touring was fun, but like it got relentless to me. I way more prefer sitting at my house making things and then seeing them in formats like this. You know what I mean? This is something special because it's being like shown on giant buildings in downtown San Francisco. That was cool. That was, that was really cool. Actually.